Steve Conroy, go ahead. Hey, Trent, how you doing? Congratulations on the deal. Thank you, Steve. Appreciate it. Good, good. Just looking back on your, your rookie season, how, how do you evaluate it in, in what, what do you want to, to work on going forward? Um, I think, uh, you know, it was a good, good year. Um, I think it came out hot. Uh, I'm sure there's points where um, I wasn't as great of a player as I wanted to be. And there's times where I was, uh, you know, playing well. So um, I thought overall it was a good season. Um, you know, it was a bummer. Uh, we came short, but uh, overall it was a good season. Um, but what I need to work on is probably just uh, my skating uh, and more confidence with the puck, you know, making that uh, that uh, right play just with confidence, I guess. Yeah. Do, do you get the sense that you may have hit, you know, the as they say, the rookie wall? Um, I don't know. I mean, uh, I was kind of, I guess, hitting that, and then I got sick. Um, and I don't think I came back uh, quite as well as I should have. And, um, that was, I guess, when they kind of hit that wall. Thank you. Yeah. We'll go to Matt Porter. Yeah. Hey, Trent, uh, congrats. And first of all, where are we, uh, where are we talking to you right now? Where, where are you at? Uh, I'm in my room right now. <laughs> at my parents, <laughs> I mean, at my parents' house. Oh, okay. So say in, okay. in St. Louis. Okay. Yeah. In St. Louis. Yep. Yeah. Um, what, what was the illness? Was, I, I know it wasn't, COVID related, we were told, is, is it just get kind of just the, the viral thing or what was it? Um, I don't know exactly. Um, I had a fever, I think like um, over the 100s for a couple of days. So I didn't, I, we don't really know exactly what it was, but it wasn't COVID. So and I mean, it was, it was worse than when I had COVID to be honest, but um, I know some people get COVID worse than others. So, yeah. So you're, I'm assuming, ready to kind of put last year behind you and, and, and look forward. And what is, what is the, the way you can gain that offensive confidence like you're talking about? Like what, what kind of areas are you focusing on in your training? Um, sprint stuff, hand stuff, kind of break that down for us. Yeah, uh, I would say like skating, um, like getting quicker. Um, so uh, just off like uh, transitional and uh, standing still. So that's kind of something I think uh, I can work on and something I need to improve on is, I guess, a bigger person with uh, bigger feet. So that's something uh, that I'm, I'm really um, making a, a point of emphasis in to do. And the hands, anything in particular that you're looking to improve there? Uh, I mean, I'm, I'm lucky. Um, I'm lucky enough to have a little something in my basement that I've been stick handling and shooting. So, uh, you know, I'm obviously going to do that, but uh, obviously everyone needs to work on their hands. So I, I'm going to try to do as much as I can. There's nothing, you know, like certain drills that I'm doing, but uh, something I'll work on for sure. Sounds good. All right. Have a good summer, man. Yeah, thank you. We'll go to Connor Ryan. Hey, Trent. Uh, congrats on the new deal. Um, thank looking you. Ahead, looking ahead to next season, um, what was the message you got from the coaching staff and management about kind of individual expectations for you next year and maybe the type of role that they're envisioning for you uh, in the lineup moving forward? Um, yeah, um, I think my end of the year meetings went well, obviously with the contract. Uh, I guess a lot of people helped me. Um, I got to thank Sweens, uh, Cam, uh, the Jacobson family and my agent, Awa, and coaching staff, they all kind of got together and um, worked out that I can come back for the next two years. So I'm excited about that. And then just the whole um, getting ready for next year and they show trust in two-year deal and stuff like that. So I don't know if that answered your question exactly, but. Yeah, in terms of just uh, what they kind of mapped out for your your place in the lineup next year, what they're hoping to get from you on the ice, you know, do they kind of communicate what, the overall, you know, what they're hoping to, to get from you next year? Um, I mean, we didn't really get into exactly uh, like what lines. Obviously, I have to come in next year and uh, prove my worth, uh, just getting in the lineup. And then just like any year, um, lines get shuffled, you know, after game one, something can be set for game one and uh, game two or to game 50 can be completely different. So I guess we'll, we'll just have to see. I don't, I don't know exactly either. Gotcha. Thanks, Trent. Yeah. 
We'll go to Chris Ryan. Hey, Trent. Uh, congrats on the new deal. Um, just what do you Thank look you. back last year? Do you look at it as kind of an introduction, kind of a start and getting things going? Or was there you know, disappointment about, obviously, what happened, not being able to get back into the lineup after the, uh, the illness and be a part of the numbers game? Yeah. Uh, no, I mean, for sure get my feet wet. I think this is just uh, just the beginning for my uh, hockey career, I guess. And I think I have a lot more to offer. Um, obviously, I was disappointed and that we uh, didn't make it to that we're not playing right now. And obviously, I wanted to help out as well. So, but, you know, everything happens for a reason. And, um, you know, sometimes it's out of your control and you just got to keep working hard and work to the next day. You go into next season feeling like you are going to be a big part of the Bruins for four years to come. And there's been a lot of talk about, you know, depth and the third and fourth line guys and getting that, those types of contributions. Do you, do you feel like you're going to be a big part of things for, for years to come? Uh, yeah. I mean, that's what I'm striving towards. Um, you know, I've got a lot of work to uh, become that. And I think, uh, I think I have the ability to, to become that. I think I will, but obviously uh, I have some work ahead of me to do that. Thanks. Have a good summer. Thanks. Appreciate it. Thank you, Trent. And thank you, Mia, for joining us.